I'm Judith Jones, food and travel editor of the Gourmet Travelista, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make flash cooked kale with lemon juice. So for this, we're going to need four cups of Dino kale, which I've washed, cut, and destemmed. Now with the stems, I've cut them into finely chopped little pieces. We have salt and pepper to taste, and we have half a cup of lemon juice and two tablespoons of olive oil. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to heat my non-stick pan to a medium heat and add in the olive oil. Swivel that round a little. Now, we are first going to add our um, kale stems. These are much tougher than the leaves, of course, so these need to be cooked first for about three to five minutes. So we're just gonna put them in there. So we're gonna let those stems get a little softer and brown a little. So a lot of people don't like cooking with the stems because they are much tougher and they're quite bitter. But the stems contain a lot of good nutrients, minerals, and vitamins. So I like cooking with them. And plus, when you saute them, they get nice and soft and brown, which I don't mind at all. All right, so that has started to cook up nicely. So now we will add, so add the kale to the mix. Be careful for that hot oil spitting. And we're just gonna, mix it all around. So we're going to cook that just for another few minutes until the kale begins to wilt and maybe get slightly brown if you like it like that. So as it's cooking you can see that beautiful green color of the kale popping out and a lot of people like to flash cook and saute the kale like this because they like to present that kale nice and colorful and green because obviously when you braise it or when you um, boil it for a long time it loses the color and also loses the nutrients so that is just about done and before our next step we're gonna take off the heat so we've taken our sauteed kale off the heat and let it cool ever so slightly and now we're going to add in our lemon juice. That's right. Now I love, love putting lemon juice with kale. It really reduces the bitterness. And I love that citrus kind of taste with kale. It's just a very nice balance between the two. And of course, I'm going to add a little bit of salt and some black pepper. Stir it up a little bit. We'll get that juice nicely through the kale. And then we can just plate it up. And let the juice drizzle a little on top if you like. And that, my friends, is flash cooked kale with lemon juice. Well, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to check out some of our other fabulous videos and be sure to subscribe to us. And if you have any questions or queries, you can email us at requests at mahalo.com. Thanks again.